So we're still in Karlsruhe after round six and we're talking with international master Nicolas Löbbe. Nicolas, how are you doing so far in this tournament? Yeah, it's a good tournament so far. I uh, drew in the first round, which was not very good. Um, but I managed to win four rounds. Uh, last round against uh, Rainer Buhmann, which was a great success. And now I drew against uh, Kutsuov uh, with a move repetition. After 15 moves, slightly better position. But uh, yeah, it's, it's fine, really. But it's not too bad when you play at 9 o'clock, have a move repetition after 15 moves to get some rest again? Yeah, that's nice. But um, I mean, I, I had the white pieces. So uh, with white, you should try to uh, win, even against uh, so strong players, because uh, w with black, it's much harder. Do you have a certain goal here for this tournament to reach a uh, grandmaster norm yeah. or whatever? Yeah, that's my goal. I want to reach my grandmaster norms. Uh, I'm already rated 2,500 and uh, now I want the title, of course. Yeah. Uh, what are you, you're really a professional chess player and what are you doing when you're not playing chess? Uh, no, I'm not a professional chess player. I mean, when I play, I try to play professional, but um, I study law and uh, chess is just uh, my biggest hobby. And your wife is also playing here in the tournament. How is she doing? She started off very good, but uh, in the last few rounds, uh, she had some uh, yeah, tactical positions and lost a few games. So, but she's trying to recover and uh, I hope she's still achieving her goal of uh, winning some ELO points. Um, you're also writing a blog about this tournament here. Can you tell us something about that? Yeah, we are writing a blog in German on our homepage, lobeschach.de. And uh, we just try to give uh, impressions of a tournament uh, to chess players who, who cannot uh, manage to be here and just uh, give them some insights of what it is to play tournaments. And how do you like this tournament so far? It's one of the biggest opens probably in the world. Yeah, it's, um, I really love it to, to be around so many chess players. Also, also, it's some kind of crazy sometimes. But uh, yeah, of course, seeing Magnus Carlsen playing is uh, really great. Great chance. I never saw him before playing. And uh, yeah, I really like it. Is it uh, inspiring for you when you have these top players playing in the same hall? Well, maybe not in the same hall, but uh, yeah, I, Magnus for me is really inspiring because he never he never just uh, drews or gives up. He plays until the end, and I really like that. So were you a bit disappointed about the draw he played yesterday? Well, uh, I play in Groningen in a team with uh, Matthias, and so no, I'm not disappointed um, because. You know, my, my, uh, my, um, I, I won a few times against Matthias in blitz chess and he blitzed against Magnus, so maybe I would have some chances, but <laughs> no, I really, uh, I'm happy for Matthias that he drew. Very good. It's a very exciting tournament and a very good start, of course, of the tournament. Uh, but yourself, what are you going to do after this tournament? What is your next plans on the, in the world of chess and your next tournament? Um, my next tournament will be the Greek League and um, another Grandmaster Tournament in Lüneburg, yeah. So we wish you all the best of luck here in Karlsruhe and also wish you other tournaments. Yes, thank you very much.